basically these are neurons that have been plated on a tiny little electrode. Uh -huh. So can you see, if you look down, can you see that that in the middle that's like yeah. a clear yeah. circle? That's with the, that's it. Yeah, that's got electrodes. Colour there because we put the colour in? Or yeah, we put in something called phenol red. about four letters then it's the combination of letters that's the next layer of complexity so if you have an ATG that actually means start 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 like go oh. so that tells the cell when oh. it's got its transcript you know so the cells come along and it's gone a oh that's T the old oh, that's G it's written its little piece of uh, um, simple yeah it's, it's written it and then a protein comes along and binds to that string of letters and it's it's kind of scans along it until it finds ATG uh -huh. which is start and then it starts making wow. protein and so it just reads the code but it reads the code in triplets that's smart until it reaches stop which is T G A or T A. This is fascinating because when I went home, I look at the four letters. And I thought, oh, whatever the letters are, I can't remember. Yeah, but oh, so if that doesn't work. Wow, a whole thing slap collapse. Yeah. Of the DNA, the gene therapy it doesn't work just because of four letters. Because it affects their life, a whole life of their yeah. life from from the start of their life all the way up to the rest of the adults. Yeah. yeah. Because if I think about, from my experience, I have to spend a lot of time with language, speech therapy. Mm -hmm. So I never learned another language, French. We had French compulsory. I was told yeah. not to go into French lessons. So I have to focus on my English. Wow. I have to start from bottom. So if you've got epilepsy, you're missing out yeah, miss life it. experience. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. So, and that's what sets us back. Yeah. Why... Why did you become an artist? Why? Because of deafness, when I was at school, primary school, yeah. there's some trouble to learn or turn. Yeah? Yeah. The being is a good drawer, she copies, mm. it's good drawing. Yeah? So I think mm. art was there to give you the confidence. Mm -hmm. yeah? Okay, so it gave you confidence to express yourself and also your abilities. Yeah. To let people so know that's what you're able. So that's where abstract art started right there. Right. So I got asked my lecturer, I want to learn abstract art. I've been copying. They tell me what is abstract art, how do I get them to all the time, big chunk of it. He said, it's a seven foot canvas for you. Mm -hmm. oh. Go on then, huh? Go on then? What do I mean, go on then? Paint, huh? What do you want? Shape. Shape? Oh, I can do shape. Huh? Finished it and he said, all right, that's good. What do you see? Kind of. And he goes, can you see there's a door there and it's going through the door and there's forest in the yeah. woods. Uh, wow. <laughs> Got me in. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And hooked me That's, up. Yeah. Uh, abstract dance as well. Yeah. So it was a nice commission engaging with the community and listening to them. So represent all diversity of culture. Mm -hmm. Everybody inclusive. Mm -hmm. And key words that matter to them about mental so health. I like commission projects. I work with the community and listen to their research ideas, projects, whatever yeah. they're doing, and formulate something out of, out of a that. blank canvas. Yeah. It's a really nice thing to do. Because at the same time I've done that, I've learnt something new, I've learnt a new way of painting or dealing with them. Yeah. And can put it on my painting. Yeah.